Hey guys, this is what I've been up to today. Um, I've never been a huge fan of the sound cards that have been available, but I ordered this one from DigiRig the other day after hearing about it from Julian, Oscar Hotel 8, Sierra Tangle November. Came today in the mail. Uh, shout out to uh, my postal worker, Robin. She's always on time. So this is all that came in the package and it came pretty nondescript, but much packing beyond this wasn't really necessary. It's pretty small, guys. It's small. It has a nice aluminum case. Uh, a case we're all familiar with, uh, aluminum project cases. Comes apart into uh, four separate pieces. And it's designed to use, be used with uh, several different radios, but today we're talking about the pinouts for the uh, Lab 5.9 TX, Discovery TX500. Um, USB-C on the side and 3.5 millimeter jacks on the other side for serial and audio. Sorry, I had it upside down. And pinouts for each radio that it works with are available on the DigiRig site, but today we're talking about the TX500. So let's get at it. I am not an expert, but um, take a look at the DigiRig site. Um, they've changed the 3.5 millimeter jacks. They're now surface mount and a lot of surface mount, surface mount components. Um, there are jumpers available on the board for CIV 3.3 in my case volts. And one is marked ATT, and I'm wondering if it's a line out attenuator. Go to the site yourself and uh, become thoroughly familiar uh, with it. I think it's a good product. Um, I've got a chance to use one, and it, it does what it claims to do, and it looks well built, it feels well built. Um, go become thoroughly familiar with the site and you'll come away probably knowing more than I think I know. I actually ordered the 1.6 board and uh, my board says 1.7. So there's a question uh, that we can uh, research and get some answers on right there. Hey guys, thanks for coming by. This is just me trying to let you see what I saw today, uh, share what I know, hopefully get a chance to hear from some of you so that you can um, give me some thoughts on how you would have done it or what you know about this project. Thanks for coming by. Please, uh, I always forget to ask, but like and subscribe. Let me know if uh, these things that uh, I'm putting out here are helping at all and maybe give me some suggestions on uh, some content you'd like to see. But until next time, have a good one.